Yo, yo, we are back in After Effects. And in today's video, I'll be showing you how to create this energy outline effect inside our music video. It looks super cool and it's pretty simple to do as well. This effect was actually firstly done by Spooky. So I'm just trying to recreate it. He's a total dope guy. I'll link his socials in the description so you can check him out. But anyways, you can see I have this clip right here. So we're gonna add the effect on here. So just simply like select your clip and just hit Ctrl D on the keyboard to duplicate and make sure you are in first frame and take your rotor brush tool which is this right here and start rotoscoping out the thing that you want to glow or make the outline on it can be like a hand it can be like a chain it can be like a glock so anything that's like moving or like the focus point of the video you can like rotoscope that out so for me it's his gloves as you can see he's like wearing a gloves like a red gloves and swinging his hand around so we're gonna max out his gloves i mean rotoscope out his brush actually we just like quickly rotoscoping out if you don't know how to rotoscope it's a really simple process you can just learn it on youtube really quickly but i'll be not going over this right now then after you're done rotoscoping just go back into your composition panel and now if you hide your background clip you can see our gloves is rotoscoped out as i said in your case it might be like a hand or like a chain or something like that but for me it's gloves so we're gonna add, start adding effects into this so let's just leave our background clip hide it for now because we're gonna add effects on this so the first effect i like to add is a black and white so it's like turns into black and white of course or if you're wondering what is this how I added the effects so quickly it's like a plugin which is called fx control which allows you to add like fx really fast or if you don't have this you can use your fx and preset as always but anyways after that we're gonna add a uh, fine edges into here so it like detects the edges then you can just hit invert to invert the colors then after that you can add like a curves in it and just lower down the shadows a little bit like this or you can even bring up the highlights a little more so all the like the little lines like disappear so something like this so we we pretty much only have the fine edges on the edges of the rotoscope so something like this so now we're gonna add the energy look that we want so for that i'll be actually using sapphire so from sapphire i'll be using sapphire auto paint this is a really like an underrated plugin but it looks so cool if i like lower down the frequency you can see it has like this paint type of strokes around which looks so cool so you can put this amount to like 400 or something like that or you can go lower like 200 as well if you want like the big lines something like that you can even play with the stroke length and stroke alignment as well there's a lot of customization in here so feel free to like go around and see what works the best for you but i think this is pretty cool right now as you can see if i play through it looks something like that now to add that color and the uh, glow we'll be using obture glow if you don't already know obture glow is the plugin which allows you to add those smooth glow so we'll be using that if you don't have it you can use like a deep glow it's a cool one as well and for the color you can go over to the tint and set it to overlay and if you don't have deep glow as well you can always use like the simple glow and use like a tritone to change the color but anyways we are just gonna add an optical glow right here optical glow and you can bring up the size firstly so around like 100 to 200 so we have this kind of bloom type of effect that looks pretty cool and you can set the amount to 30 or something like that or even more if you like like 50 45 go crazy with it and then to add the color we're just gonna go over to color and in colorize we're gonna set it as our red color because my gloves was also red and the effect that spooky done on his music video is also red so we're gonna recreate that look but we're gonna enable our background layer and you won't see your background layer firstly because we applied optical glow so to fix that you can always use like the ultra channel but i like to go with blending modes if you don't see blending mode just like toggle switch in on modes and you'll see it go over to where it says normal and set it to the linear dodge now now if you play through you can see we have the effect already going on 
and it looks super cool even if you like you can add like an exposure into your background clip and hit the stopwatch in it and go over to the end frame and set it to like zero so the amount like slowly decreases as it goes so something like that as you can see that makes our hand pop off more so i really like that and now to finish it all we're gonna add an adjustment layer and add a shake from my shake pack so for it i'll be using the best one so just drag and drop the best one in here and you can just line it up and you can just trim it till here and the one thing i like to remove is the as flicker because our footage already has some flicker in it now if i play through you can see we have the crazy impact in the beginning as well looks pretty cool and helps with the transition as well so if you want to download the sick pack i'll link it in the description it's actually totally dope comes with a lot of sex for your music video so it's really worth it grabbing but anyways with that our final effect looks something like this so that's it for today's video guys if you like this video please consider hitting the like button and also subscribe to my channel for more videos like this you can even follow me on instagram because i try to put in a lot of effort on every single video of mine and i really appreciate it you can also also follow me on instagram and don't worry i know it's like the end of the month it's 30 september right now but i will not stop uploading till like another month so you can expect some consistent value for me i can take some break on october like one or two days but we'll be back so yeah see you tomorrow peace